coming right there. All right, this week on Tactical Rifleman, I want to talk about why uh, we prefer to shoot five round shot groups when we're zeroing. Now the military always shoots three round shot groups. Shoot three rounds, go back, check it. Shoot three rounds, go back, check it. Uh, that, that's fine, but this particular target that this student shot, this is textbook example why that that's just a bad idea. If you look at these shots, all right, that's a perfect triangle. And the weapon system at 25 meters is capable of shooting a group the size of a dime. So this isn't the this isn't the rifle that did this. This is the shooter pulled two of these bullets. So which two did he pull? If you were to ask the shooter, half the time they don't know. So uh, we've circled them. All right, those are the first three shots. Where do I judge this? Uh, do I say this is the center of the shot group? That's what most people do, and they would adjust from there. Uh, but how about if it was this one or that one or that one, and they pulled the other two? We're making additional corrections for no reason. Uh, and what ends up happening is you end up moving that group all over the target. So we're going to have this same shooter shoot two more bullets, and then we'll check and we'll see where the actual true center of this shot group is. All right? Let's head on back. Okay, so we weren't sure where the center of the shot group was, so we had the shooter shoot two more bullets, giving us our five round shot group. Now when we come up and check it, all right, out of the five, these three right here are real close together. That three out of five right there, we'll say that's the center of our shot group, and now we can move it. All right, it is it possible to jerk one bullet? Yeah, but it's also possible for a, uh, for a shooter to jerk two bullets. Right, so shoot a five round group. What that does is you're, you're taking out a lot of the guesswork. It'll allow you to see where, uh, where the center of that actual shot group is and it'll allow you to make more accurate corrections to the sights. So I hope you understand the method of our madness here, why we prefer our shooters shoot five rounds as opposed to just the uh, military standard of three rounds. So if you have any other questions or comments or ideas for other videos, uh, be sure to leave them below. If you like this video, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Also, make sure you follow us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter so you don't miss out on anything.